Low Earth orbit is a junkyard, full of millions of pieces of space debris. These threaten space-based services, space exploration, and pose a safety risk to people and property in space and on Earth. Fortunately, the European Space Agency has plans to do something about it. In the latest development, the UK government on Tuesday, November 17th, announced that a British firm will help build the Clear Space One satellite. Planned for 2025, Clear Space One is the first mission aimed at capturing space debris from Earth's orbit. According to OECD estimates, there are currently more than 160 million pieces of space debris in orbit, most of which are space junk. These objects come in all shapes and sizes, from spent rocket bodies to a camera and a spatula dropped by an astronaut. Space junk stems from hundreds of space missions launched since the beginning of the space age in 1957. According to NASA, the debris travels at speeds of up to 18,000 miles per hour, almost seven times faster than a bullet. This means even the tiniest piece of debris could spell disaster were it to hit the International Space Station. Swiss startup Clear Space was chosen by the ESA to lead the mission. Elekner Deimos in the UK will design Clear Space 1's attitude and orbit control system, which will orientate and position the satellite to help grab space space debris. Clear Space 1 will target a spent upper stage from an ESA Vega rocket orbiting at 720 kilometers or 447 miles above the Earth. The Clear Space 1 satellite, dubbed the CLAW, will use four robotic arms to collect debris. After Clear Space 1 captures the target, it will return to Earth's atmosphere and burn up with the rocket stage, with both disintegrating safely and away from human life. The ESA says it will refine the chaser's capabilities with the goal of launching follow-up missions in the future, including capturing multiple objects. For more news animations and explainers, hit the subscribe and bell button to join the Tomo News family. Thanks for watching.